Hey guys, I'm back with another video. We are going to talk about this, okay? We're going to talk about shops, okay? When you're in a shop, yeah, and most shops don't add up the tax. What? No, they don't. I'm warning you, they don't. What do you mean? As in, you look at Apple, yeah. Laptop costs, MacBook Air, yeah, costs 1500 okay, online, yeah. But you put that into your basket, you look at the your total there, and it says VAT is 300 what? That is the 300 and then the laptop is only 1,200. Really? That's it? As it's like, yep. And why do you think they want you to pay for the tax VAT, I mean? What do you think? Because that means then they don't have to pay it every single year. Like, oh out of their pocket exactly that's how they roll really yep exactly that's how so it's basically you buy a pair of shoes yeah that cost a hundred quid right yeah but what about the tax i mean the vat where's the vat coming from Oh, so JD Sports have to take the 100 quid shoe, yeah. So we give them 100 quid, yeah. So we, because we pay for the shoes, probably they have to take out at least 40 euro taken out of there. So the shoe only really costs less than 100 quid. Oh, and that's how they make up their money. When it comes to VAT. Added tax is called. That's how they do it. Really? Yep. But they don't. JD Sports don't even add up their tax. There. We don't pay it. You look at Apple brands. Yeah. What do you think? Um, The AirPods. Yeah. Cost what? 100 quid. 200 quid. Yeah. So, 200 quid for air, air buds, yeah. You look, put that into your shopping trolley online, yeah. You look at your receipt there, right, before you even buy it, anything. There, tax there, 50 quid. 50 euro. There, so they're only 150 really to, to buy, but tax added on to there is 200 quid altogether. Whoa. And that's how Apple makes their fortune. Oh. So that's how they do it. Yep. It is. You're going to, when you're buying your normal food shop. Yeah. There's tax added on to that privately. They don't show the tax. So if something, like a loaf of bread. Yeah. What do you think that's like? two euro it used to be 150 for a loaf of bread for brennan's bread yeah but now it's two euro that's like what yeah 50 cent any person that buys a loaf of bread there for brennan's bread yeah you're paying 50 cent of tax for that loaf of bread there out of your one euro and fifty cent, so the loaf of bread only costs one euro. Yeah. Oh, but now it's gone up to two euro. So n n now, like the loaf of bread costs two euro, so it's gonna like, whoa. So that's how they add up their pay the tax. So yeah, you're paying tax for the loaf of bread there as well. Some of them are deeply hidden. Really, yeah. They are like that because you can just order the bread online 
there from Don's, from Tesco, from other branches like Super Value as well. I don't know about Lidl or Aldi or anything like that now, you know, but Tesco do it as well there. You can look up there and it says the, the VAT on it there. I was like, oh. So they do actually collect up the tax. Yep. They do for the for the entire buyings of you. Whatever you bought. There. It's like, what the hell? I was like, yep. That is freaking amazing. Some companies, yeah. You're going to cash and carry, actually, okay? Yeah. You're buying boxes of um sweets right you're buying dairy milk uh bars okay because i gotta put a shitload for my birthday if you actually seen that video there bought a good few of those there so i got one box those there i don't know how many was in the box to be fair with you yeah and so it cost altogether cost 20 quid altogether maybe even more than that there and then I looked at the tax there. Tax there is sixty percent. There or six percent, sorry. I was like, what the hell? A bit pricey. I was just like, yep. So if that was so that's thirty euro altogether, yeah, for the one box there filled with sweet with dairy milks. Yeah. And add on six euro onto that there. Yeah, 36 altogether. Oh shit. It costs that much. It's almost 40 quid altogether. Oh, it's only five euro off. Basically, you know. It's like, Jesus Christ. Yep, cash and carry makes you pay for your vat. There. Why should they be paying for it? There. True. And that's how some shops lose out on that. Really? Yep. They do. You buy a scooter. Yeah. You buy a BMX. You buy a hammer. You buy a wheel. Yeah. There's that on that too. Really? Yep. There is there. It'll, they'll tell you as well. Say you look at that, um, two tires need to be replaced plus fat altogether is this price. Oh, fuck's sake. You'd be like that. You look at Apple brands, I'm telling you, everyone loves Apple brands. You look at buying your iPhones, yeah, your brand new iPhone 11 Max, Pro Max. There, your iPhone 11 with the two cameras at the back of it, what I have. There, you buy your phone there like that, you look at the VAT. Oh shit, it's like 200 quid. There, the phone only, only, um, cost all to, like, all together was eight, but they included the 200 quid added on to that. So it's all, all together, 800 quid, so you minus the VAT, for instance, just for this video. Whoa. Only, so, it was eight, so eight, seven, six, so it only cost six, 600 euro altogether for the iPhone 11 with the two cameras. Yep. Oh my God. Sick, like, yep. That's how we roll. And that's how Apple make their big old money there. And that's how they collect all their vat there give it to the tax man that what we did and then that's how they keep their own stash of millions then of apple shares and that's how it's run all day all night you look at shops there the way they do it with those little prices there as in like there's like whoa if you get um 50 euro yeah and on your next shop then you get 10 euro off yeah but they're getting uh, your 10 euro back oh 
So you're spending, yeah. So that's how they make their money out of you. They want you to come back then to spend and spend and spend. And then they get richer and richer and richer. That's how shops do it. You know? Absolutely do. You know? Madness it is. There. You go into... You look at your... Your tax on your car there, right? Why should the motor insurance pay... For... Your tax... I mean, for your tax. You know what I mean? You have to pay the tax... There, so you're like, oh, for fuck me. I had to pay that too. It's like, yep, because that's how they save money. So whatever it costs to run your machine on the roads, yeah. Guards look at your tax there. Why? You didn't pay the tax, man. There whatsoever, did you? No... I forgot to. Their taxman has loads of money. That's not the point. The point is that you have to be paying the tax. VAT, my good man. Okay. Fine, I'll pay it. So, you pay the tax. That at a tax there. Yeah. And then... And then, they use your money that you gave to them. They keep that then in a little box or something, hide it underneath their pillow, and then they give it to the bank. Then I said, like, Yeah, I paid all my taxes there for the year. And then I still made the profit then of what they actually made. Oh, so that's how it runs. Yep, yeah, you buy a TV, yeah, and it's only for 500 euro. There, yeah. You look at the VAT there. Depends what percentage of uh, VAT you're paying for anything. Do you look at it there. Oh, 100 quid VAT there. It's like, yep. So the TV only costs 400 quid, not 500. Yep. So that 100 euro tax, yeah, that you pay there. Well, 500 altogether, but... They take their 100 quid of tax then in their back pocket, give it to the tax man then, and then they keep the 400 quid then for themselves, then for the shop. Oh, that's how they do it. And use that money then for the people's wages then. Oh, so that's how they do it. Yep, that's how it rolls. To be honest with you guys. And that's how Apple play it. Like that. You buy something from Apple there. That cost 200 quid there. 50 euros taken out there. For the tax man for the end of the year. Yeah 150 then. Is kept. Then for. People's wages then that work for Apple. Oh. Same in shops. Same in anywhere. And that's how. They make the profit. Oh. Because you're paying tax as well on top of that. If tax. VAT weren't on. On on anything. Then things would be a lot cheaper. There. Houses would be a lot cheaper. If there is no tax. There. Really? Yep. Thanks guys and I'll see you in the next video.